Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Noelle and I do unboxings, mostly lifestyle subscription boxes, but also some stationery, books, beauty, jewelry, travel, home decor, and even the very occasional dash of Disney. So if you enjoy unboxings, I hope you'll consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell. And that way you'll find out whenever I post new videos, which is usually at least once a day, if not twice, whenever I announce giveaways and whenever I go live. As always, if you're already subscribed, thank you so much for being here and welcome Welcome back. I know this is a super busy time of year, so I definitely appreciate you taking a little time out of your day to watch my videos. I do hope that you enjoy them. I definitely enjoy hearing from you in the comments and of course over on Instagram as well. Today I have a great monthly lifestyle box that I've been opening here on the channel almost since the beginning and that is single swag, which of course is not just for single women. It's really just a lifestyle box for ladies. There's a nice a variety of self-care items. Sometimes we'll get some jewelry. Sometimes it's a little bit overpriced jewelry, but I definitely always think you're getting a great value on this box. The full box is $39.99, but if you use the link that I'll leave for you in the description box below, you can save $15. That is the case even with their petite box, which is just $24.99, so you can still save that $15, which I think is a fantastic deal. You get about four to five items, I believe, in the petite box. Usually it is the jewelry piece as well as the snack, which is usually valued around four or five but let's go ahead and get into this box. This is one of the boxes that I actually pay for just because I do think it's a fun one to see what variations we get each month and they always tend to ship on time. I just got this box in the mail, so I didn't actually pre-score it, I just realized. So I'm gonna go ahead and use my scissors and be a little dangerous, even though I have a nice box cutter in the other room. All right, you guys, so inside, they still have their black tissue paper, which I'm waiting for them to one day get tissue paper that kind of matches the exterior of the box a little bit better. They just kind of throw everything in there. There's never any shred or like little pockets of air to kind of keep things from getting uh, messed up in there, but every Everything seems to make it okay because for the most part a lot of the items especially the beauty products tend to come in their own little boxes but they don't ever like seem to have like really bent edges or corners so I'm okay with it the only time I'm a little bit worried is if we have something that's kind of a crumbly treat for our snack so on one side of the card that's always included they do tell us all of the items that are in there along with the retail values again sometimes I feel like those retail values seem a bit inflated but I do always think that you're getting your money's worth so it says our total retail value for this December boxes, $221. So even if everything was inflated by, you know, 100%, I still think you're getting half that retail value. So closer to $100, which is still a pretty good deal on a $40 box. So it does say that we have got, like I said, eight items. And I am seeing that there is, as always, our jewelry piece, as well as a snack. Now, I have to say for a little while, I was kind of hard on the jewelry. And I'd say like for every other month, I would like it. And then sometimes it would feel like a little bit like young but I have been really pleasantly surprised for the past few months so knock on wood hopefully we get uh, get a nice jewelry piece for the end of the year so just says put yourself at the top of your priority list every single day relax smile and enjoy this month's special surprise just for you so kind of a fun play on words for single swag right something to enjoy every single day whether or not you have a ring on your finger all right let's open the first thing up so this is from dr botanicals which is a brand that we know and love here on the channel so they usually have great items this is a coffee and walnut superfood renewing facial exfoliator for all skin types all right so i'm gonna have to uh go ahead and break the seal on this one too because it does have like a little a little um sticker on it and by little I mean it goes all the way across the seam of the box so it's making it very difficult for me to get into but let me find it here on the uh, on the card this has a value of $22 which does seem a bit high for this little uh 1.01 fluid ounces so it's just a little bit over one ounce uh, it says this gentle yet effective formula is packed with a cocktail of anti-inflammatory ingredients and skin smoothing fruit extracts that buff away dead skin cells to reveal a soft radiant complexion leaving behind a soft smooth and glowy feeling vegan natural and cruelty free so I do love that about Dr. Botanicals so I mean seems worth trying but remember not to overuse your exfoliators I definitely have had some issues when I kind of like because I just love how my skin feels after using them but you can definitely use them too much so only like maybe once a week or so. All right, ooh, Trifle Cosmetics. This is really cute packaging. It says soft swirl overnight hydrating face mask. Okay, so it looks like it's got like little candy twists on it. Let's see what it says about this one. So this has a value of 
Wow, $48, except for our jewelry piece, which is almost always, oh, this time our jewelry piece is only $52. Usually it's like $58. Um, so it's almost the most expensive item in, in the box. It says this supercharged moisturizer infused with real fruit and nutrients such as grapefruit, grapefruit, giant granadilla, and avocado butter helps to refine pores and nourishingly plump skin without irritating it. Vegan, paraben-free, and cruelty-free. Those are all good like adjectives there at the end. So wow, I did didn't know that this uh, 3.5 ounce little uh, tube would be worth $48. I haven't, I think I've heard of Trifle Cosmetics. Have you in the comments below let me know? But this sounds really nice. Sounds like a hydrating face mask worth giving a try. I wonder how often you're supposed to use it. So it says, apply a generous layer onto just clean skin after five to 10 minutes, dab off excess with a tissue, do not rinse and allow to work overnight, wash off in the morning, best used once a week or whenever skin needs extra pampering. So, all right, so drier months, probably good for it. What is this? This is like, huh, oh, it smells, smells like lavender. So it's like a little like Ziploc bag, but I'm gonna go ahead and open it. So it's a eye soother. So it's a little eye pillow. I don't use a lot of eye pillows because of my eyelash extensions, but sometimes towards the end, like when I'm about to go back to uh, get my fill, I will uh, go ahead and use them. This is kind of cute though, because the pattern matches the bag. So we've got little eyes on it. So that would be really kind of cute to have over your face. That's actually adorable. Um, it smells so good, you guys, the lavender, and you can kind of feel that there's seeds in there. Um, wow, this this is actually smells really good. So it's a uh, value of $24. It says this calming restorative eye pillow provides a spa-like experience at home or on the go. The aromatic lavender and flaxseed work to depuff, de-stress, and rejuvenate your eyes and mind. Apply as is or cool in the refrigerator to relieve tired and puffy eyes. I don't think this sleeve comes off, so you can't necessarily wash it so I will probably hold on to this now that I've opened it but it's by banter beauty smells really good you can always use it as a sachet like in a drawer as well so so far we're doing pretty good on our items so here is our jewelry piece so this is by Gemma Simone this is a designer uh, or brand that appears in single swag pretty often they usually just come like it's like they make their own packaging so it's not like a nice little jewelry box it's usually just like this paper cardboard thing I mean it looks kind of nice in terms of being able to slide it out like that but I usually, if I re-gift the jewelry, will put it into like a fancier like jewelry box. This supposedly has a value of $52. It is a demi silver necklace and earrings set. It says, add style and elegance to your collection with this chic silver necklace with an eight-sided matte black charm and round stud earrings. The necklace measures 17 inches long with a 13 inch extender. All right, you guys, so we got a set. Let's see what it looks like. So I opened up the box that slid out of the sleeve. Huh. These are, this, the necklace is kind of cool. It looks like I need to kind of wipe it clean though because it is matte. So you can kind of see any scuffs that it got just from being inside of the box. So let me, let me wipe it clean. I actually kind of like the necklace cause it's kind of like hardcore. It's almost a little like punk. So we got these little stud earrings, which I probably won't use. They just, they do have like multi facets. So they almost look like druzy in a weird way. It's kind of interesting that they gave us these like sparkly earrings and then this matte black, is it octagonal or yes, it's an octagonal like kind of bead. So it's kind of got some dimension to it. You can kind of see. It's interesting. I'm almost seeing like a Mickey Mouse head there. Um, I like the necklace though, because I think it's kind of neat that it has the like silver outline. I like that it just almost looks like a button you would push. Um, that's a kind of cool piece. I don't know that I would pay $52 like out in the non sub box world, but it's always a fun thing to receive. And you know, it's not like the highest quality jewelry, um, but it's always fun to get like a new jewelry piece that you can kind of just like wear every day for that month and enjoy. And then if it starts to tarnish or you, re-gifted or you lose it you don't feel like that terrible because you got it in a box that you probably got for a pretty good deal along with a bunch of other fun things we got something from Kaleido Cosmetics, uh, Euphoria Blush. It says Luminous Blush. Okay, so here is the packaging. It does have some like swirlies on the side. So let me see uh, what it says about this. Where is it? This is the Euphoria Blush. It has a value of $14. This super soft, luminous blush full of true to pan pigments lets you layer on a rapturous glow with no fallout or chalkiness. It is vegan, cruelty free, talc free, and paraben free. So it just came in this little individual pan, pretty cute. And then I'll see if I can open it up without making a mess. It's got this little hot air balloon pressed into it with some clouds. That's actually really sweet. Very, very cute. Um, so what does it say? 
say about this this is a blush so i don't wear blushes a lot because i have naturally rosy cheeks which i've just recently learned could just be my rosacea which has decided to flare up but um i don't usually wear blush but you could definitely use that like as a part of your eyeshadow or i will probably re-gift that in all honesty to someone who does do a little bit more in terms of makeup we have something from Empower Her Beauty. So it's Empow, and then they put in brackets her, Empower Her Beauty. Um, so it's a foot lotion. All right, this is a really pretty package for foot lotion. So it says hydrating foot lotion. This has a value of $32. It's also sealed. It says your feet need love too. So treat them to ultimate hydration. Apply lotion to clean feet and rub in a circular motion from the tips of the toes to the heel. Repeat as needed. I have to say, so I usually have like hobbit feet because you guys know I don't wear a lot of shoes and socks. So I go barefoot a lot and wear flip flops a lot. So I tend to have a lot of calluses. Like when I get a pedicure, they're always like, do you want to do the callus remover? And I'm like, no, because I kind of like having tough feet. Like I like being able to go barefoot when I need to, um, to like walk on hot sand, et cetera, et cetera. But also um, I just, I'm used to them being that way, but they definitely need a little bit of love sometimes. But the past year and a half, because I haven't been out and about that much barefoot, my feet have looked a little bit better. And my husband's been a little bit more amenable to actually giving me a foot rub here and there. But I feel like asking him to actually use a foot lotion on top of that would be too much because then he realized that it was like an actual, you know, you know it'd be more than like a quick like two minute love rub it'd be like an actual event so one of these days though i'll have to put that on my wish list for christmas like i want a real foot love where you rub where you foot love foot love where you give me some uh em empower beauty foot lotion love so really really pretty uh metal tube so it's one of those ones that gets really denty so that's kind of nice that they gave it to us in the nice box I may pass this on. I have a bunch of foot creams that I just need to be more diligent about actually using, but these are the months of the year when we should be using them. Then, oh, you guys, this month's uh, snack, this month's treat is good. Sometimes we'll get like a brownie or like, you know, trail mix. We'll get those purulines. That's one of my favorite things that does come in single swag, you know, every few months. This time we got a nice big milk chocolate bar from Choco Yoko. Um, look how big the bar is. This is awesome. So this has a value of $5. I told you it's usually between four and five. So you would get this in the petite box most likely along with the jewelry. It says indulge in this delectable premium chocolate bar prepared with high quality cocoa beans and extra cocoa butter for balance and texture. I'm usually a dark chocolate girl, but um, I'm also equal opportunity when it comes to all of the chocolates. I will even eat white chocolate, even though it's not like my favorite, even though it's not really chocolate. Um, a good milk chocolate sometimes is awesome. I have to say like the other day we had something in it like I, I just always, when I purchase it for myself, I always buy dark chocolate. And it was like, whatever we had, it was something and milk chocolate. And my husband and I were like, oh yeah, milk chocolate for the win. This is, this is pretty good. And then we have one final thing, which is appropriate, of course, for a December box. Although if you were a real, if you're a real planner person, you probably already have your planner set up and you've probably already filled out most of January, if not other months. So we do have a really simple planner. It's just like a very flat booklet. It says 2022, the best is yet to come. So it is a dated planner, which I actually really prefer versus all the blank ones that we get. Although I do get the, uh, the, the benefits of having blank journals as well, because then you don't have to use it for a specific year. And if you wind up with five different dated planners, that's not the best. It's like pink splatter paint. It almost looks like one of those old school composition journals, but in pink. So it says this has a value of $24. This is from Molly Jacobs, which is like a brand that I feel like they do all kinds of different items. Like I think I've gotten like makeup brushes from Molly Jacob. I've gotten, you know, this pl planner and calendar. It's just like a paper like booklet. So $24 seems a bit high in all honest um, honesty. So it just says the Molly Jacobs planner on the inside cover. This is your year. Um, all right. So we just have a uh, calendars like this where there's actually lines on the days so if you're someone who likes to be super duper neat you might enjoy that and then after we get through the calendar um, all the way January through December then you just have like blank note pages with uh, lines so okay so there's a, okay so each month you get a few note pages afterwards so I don't know what I would use this for. It's a, more like long-term planning, like more like vacations and stuff that you need to see at a glance. I like a 
planner where I actually have like weekly pages so I can actually have like to-do lists for each week. Um, so this is not something that I will probably use but I will probably like gift it to somebody in the next few weeks so they have the opportunity to use it. So it says 2022 is almost here and the best is yet to come. Stay organized and keep track of all your activities and important dates with this planner featuring uh, monthly overview pages and two line pages behind each month for additional notes. I could have just read that instead of flipping through it. Produced with high quality weighted paper, throw this planner into your handbag or keep on your desk at home or the office for everyday use. So I think this is a good planner to use in conjunction with something else or maybe if you're just like not really a planner person then you could use this and it's like a very like lightweight sort of situation or if you're someone who has most of their plans digitally like I was up until you know maybe a year or two ago when I started this YouTube channel and I realized I needed to be like both digital and analog and be able to see things and be able to travel with things and not always have to have all my passwords with me and to be able to like write like more extensive notes so this would be good for someone. I probably won't use it because I have already started filling out my planner, a dated planner for 2022. It's very exciting to do that. It's that fun, fresh start experience. But this is overall a pretty good single swag box. In all honesty, I will probably keep getting single swag in the new year for a little bit longer. I think if you are looking for a well-priced, fun monthly treat, this is a good option for sure. So we got our Empower Her Beauty Hydrating Foot Lotion, which I am excited to try my feet are excited as well that had the value of $32 our trifle cosmetics our expensive item hydrating face mask at a value of $48 our banter beauty lavender and flax eye, flax seed eye soother value of $24 our premium European milk chocolate bar one of the other like things I'm most excited about our demi silver necklace and earrings set kind of interesting design I don't really feel like they make a great set but nice individual pieces $52 Dr. Botanicals Coffee and Walnut Superfood Renewing Facial Exfoliator at $22. Our Kaleido Cosmetics Euphoria Blush, that little palette with the little uh, hot air balloon on it. And then finally, our Molly Jacobs uh, Planner and Calendar in this very hot pink. So let me know in the comments below what you guys thought about this December singles swag. And uh, if I should keep opening it here on the channel, it tends to do pretty well in terms of views. I think you guys like seeing what they have to offer. Um, and then let's go ahead and choose another winner in our 12 days of box miss giveaway. So if you haven't been following along from December 1st through the 12th, I was announcing secret passwords in some of the videos. You still have time to enter. And then from now, from actually the 13th through the 24th, in my videos, I will be announcing winners to receive mystery mailers from me that I will be sending out after the holidays. So hopefully there'll still be some fun stuff in there. So these are a little bit smaller than the mystery boxes that I usually send out in my giveaways. I just wanted to be able to send out a little bit more to thank you guys for being subscribers. So I'm going to go to my random number picker and we had a little over 300 entries to date. I'm going to wait to film the next uh, set of videos so that you have more opportunities to win. You just have to make sure you get all of those passwords in, all of your entries in by the 17th to be guaranteed to be entered in some of these giveaways. So let's see, here we go. So our random number is 180 and then I just have to go over to my drive where I have my Excel spreadsheet where I can tell you <laughs> whose name goes with 180 and that is our very own, wow, you're very lucky this this holiday season, our very own Jessie Miller unboxings and more. So Jessie has her own channel. If you haven't already checked it out, definitely check it out. She just won a giveaway, I'd say like a couple of months ago. So this is really fun. You might have to go and buy a lottery ticket too, Jessie. But you just have to uh, get in touch with me. You have so many ways that I already know you can get in touch with me to just verify your mailing address and I will do my best to get that out in a timely fashion. I'm not guaranteeing uh, getting any of these mailers out though until at least after the holiday or I might get them out a little bit sooner. We'll see. We'll see. But I've just been kind of busy trying to catch up on videos, trying to catch up on photos, but you will be probably seeing double up days in terms of two videos a day from now until the end of the year. I hope you guys enjoy it. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you all very, very soon in my next unboxing.